Hey, peeps, Angel here. Monday, November 14, 2016. Again, gorgeous day out there. My goodness, this is amazing. This weather, it's it's unbelievable throughout the entire weekend. And my goodness, it's, it's, it's cold out there. Um, it's been like in the uh, high 50s at night and uh, right on the 70s during the day. So it's just pleasant. I have never witnessed anything like this before. That the month of October, now counting Matthew, of course, on the start, but the month of October and now November has just been phenomenal. Uh, I just hope that November continues to be that way. December is kind of like the same. Um, and hopefully we have a great Thanksgiving and a great Christmas this year. But what can I say about the weekend? Uh, let's start with Friday. Uh, the kids were actually off for Veterans Day on Friday and... Uh, I did my video earlier so I could give my my uh, family the the time that they need. As every other Friday, that's like our family day, if you want to call it. But having the kids over, um, we plan it pretty good. We I, I asked my wife if if they, the kids wanted to go to the park, but they decided not to because our pass is only till December thirty first. So. Um, they wanted to go see the new Trolls movie, and we went around 11.45 for the matinee, and my goodness, what an awesome movie. Um, the music, the soundtrack, you know, you have Justin Timberlake and Gwen Stefani also. Um, the Trolls are so funny, and it's kind of weird because it's from my era um, back in the 90s, so we're talking about the Trolls came out maybe 20, 25 years ago. And now they're, it's like coming back. It's kind of like the Turtles, you know. They came out in the late 80s. And then it just it became a success back in the 90s with the trilogy that they did. And then the cartoons and stuff like that. But then they try to bring them back in a different, completely different way. I, and they've done already two movies. I hope they actually they do a, a trilogy just like they did before. Uh, with what they've done bef because my kids are loving it. You know, my daughter... Already, you know, we asked her, what do you want for Christmas? She said, I want the new Ninja Turtles movie, the second one. I was like, okay, cool. <laughs> I don't know. Rocksteady and Bebop maybe is because she wants it, you know. But, I mean, she was April O'Neil for Halloween. And we were all, the other, we all were the Ninja Turtles, the two, my two boys, my, my wife and myself. So, um, it's really cool that they're bringing these. So, the trolls bringing them, you know, back in the day we had the little dolls and and the hair puffing up from it, and now they actually build it as a movie. It's a really cool movie. If you guys have kids or you just like animation movies, go watch it. It's really cool, and the music and the soundtrack is amazing. I think that really made the movie. The comedy of it, like they have for kids, as always, DreamWorks always does a great job with comedy. But I have to say the music is really good. Like even It's so good that I even told... My wife meant it. We finally find the soundtrack. We should really get it for the kids so that way they can have fun with it. But uh, after that, uh, my wife, my daughter actually was AB honor roll in school. And we told her, okay, well, you're going to choose for that. You're going to choose lunch. And we were able to have some Chinese. She loves Chinese, so we were able to spend some time there. Um, I play some baseball with my son that he's been asking me for a while to play with him, which was really cool and fun. And then, of course, you know how Saturdays and Sundays roll with my wife having to work and stuff like that. Um, and, but this Sunday was great. Church was great. Excuse me. Oh, oh getting tired. <laughs> um, sorry. <laughs> hey, I'm just a regular dude, man. But uh, um, today was really nice. Just another day at work. Um, very nice, very pleasant. A lot of work as always, and uh, working on my new um, three classes for this uh, trimester, which I started working on a few things here and there. And then um, just got home, I had to go to the groceries, do a few things, and got home, put all the kids to sleep. And actually, my wife really wanted to watch this movie called With Honors, which I had I had seen back in the '90s, but I have not seen it since then, which is kind of funny. And I was able to actually see it again. And man, what a great movie. Uh, I don't know if you guys have been able to see this movie called With Honors. But my goodness, it's 
just a great life experience story. I'm not going to say too much about it so you guys get a chance, but it's about this guy that's going to Harvard. He loses his thesis. Um, and then this, this guy that lives on the streets, he finds it, and then he tells him, well, he was burning it. And he tells him, um, I know it all. I'm very smart, and I know your thesis. I'll rewrite it for you if you do things for me, like give him food, let him take a bath, stuff like that. But the life story that goes in it is what really drives me and and what really hit me hard to, man, something like that, you know, we shouldn't take life, you know, so hard. We should just live it to our fullest and... Um, we should light the fire and, and continue to build a better world with all the craziness that is going around. And um, I believe seeing his story, you know, the, the, the man that didn't have a home story and everything that goes through his life. Um, we should grab rocks and remember what God has actually done for us and understand what he has for us next. Um, but I'm very excited for the, uh, opportunity of watching the movie today and giving me a different perspective in life and, uh, taking life for granted and, and running with honors, even though you don't, you don't get the right paper, you don't get the diploma, you don't get whatever it's that is there. The goal is heaven. And it's doing the right things to honor God with all that we have. And live life with honor. And today I tell you guys, if you guys are lost, if you don't have anything, man, God is always right there knocking on your door. And all that he wants from you is for you to give him all the honor and glory that he surely should be getting. Again, guys, as always, this is my diary. I hope you guys have a fantastic day tomorrow. Please subscribe to my channel. I love you all. And please live with honors. Life is this short. We don't have that much time. Let's live it out. And let's honor our God. Who will the more. He deserves it. Love you guys. Have a good night. See you guys tomorrow. Peace.